Hey guys, Novi here with a cool little concept. It's a configurable pulse multiplier. So what that means is you push one button and you get many different, um, many pulse outputs, which is configurable. So at the moment we have it giving 16 pulses because we have 16 blocks in here. Uh, 16 pulses for every time you click the button. And as you can see, we're just going to measure this because this is the output here, this repeater, and that leads into a dropper, 51 blocks, and none in the chest. So theoretically, we should get 16 blocks in there. So uh, let's give it a go. Push that. That's just going to pulse. As you see, each time this pulses, it sends a signal into the dropper, goes up into there. And we get a signal off that one as items pass through it. And then they get stuck in here due to a pulse lengthener. Um, and then they all get stuck in there, the items do. And then when the items stop flowing through it, they all get dumped into that. Uh, so that's basically how it works. Um, and let's just check how many items we've got out of that. we got 16. Perfect. Um... We'll just do another number for now as well, just to show you that it works. Um, say we want to do 11. Yep, we want 11 items in there now. Let's do it again. Now guys, I'm making this video as I'm thinking that why let me have all the fun? Why not let you guys try and compact it as well? So thought, yeah, why not? And I'll just stare over the circuit in a moment so you can build it yourself and then compact it down from there. Then, as you can see, we've got 11 blocks output. So, works absolutely perfectly. But anyway, um, I'd like to thank guys for watching. I hope you have a nice day. And I guess I'll see you all later. That's three ticks, by the way. And that's actually configurable. <laughs> um, so you can change the delay between each pulse. But anyway, bye-bye. <laughs> uh,